Well, it sure was a great day today. The sun was shining again. We're also feeling summer like warmth. So, how long will it be in the region? Chief Meteorologist Kate Bynum is back now with your full forecast. Hey, Kate. Hey, Yuki. I'm so excited over here that I'm bobbling the clicker. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you heard hit the ground there. We have some beautiful weather on the way to finish out the work week. Temperatures are headed to the 80s. We felt just shy of the 80s today, but by tomorrow, I think it's going to feel a little bit more like summer than fall. And I think people are kind of split into two camps. There's the group that loves the nice warm weather, wants it to stay. And then there's the group that wants to break out the sweaters and the wool socks and cozy up under a blanket by a bonfire and not sweat it out. We've got that kind of weather for you as well. But let's start with the warm stuff. 68 degrees outside right now in the city. Feels like 68 as well. Dew points are comfortable. About 59 degree dew point right now. Winds out of the west northwest at three miles per hour. Storm scan three looking fine. Nothing going on outside. Just a few patchy clouds. But here's the cold front that's going to bring some changes. All this cool Canadian air locked up behind it. And once this front really starts to progress through, we're going to basically open the refrigerator door. So to speak, and let that cool air blast in. It's going to slide in over the weekend. So the weekend will be split. One day feeling more like summer, one day feeling much more like fall. Tonight, 61 degrees, partly cloudy, very comfortable. Tomorrow, I don't think we see the fog out there in the morning. So with more sun, it is going to heat up quickly. 83 degrees will be the high. Keep in mind, our average final day in the 80s in any given year is October 7th. So we are way ahead of schedule or behind schedule, whichever way you want to look at it. And 83 is pretty warm. I don't think we're going to get there again for quite some time. So enjoy it while we have it. Warm and a bit more humid tomorrow. Future weather showing again tomorrow afternoon. Looking good. Partly to mostly sunny. A very nice, bright day. But here comes our cold front. Saturday starts off okay with a mix of clouds and sun. Southwest wind, it's going to heat up quickly to around 80 degrees. But here's this front lurking off to the west, and this will slide through in the afternoon. Between about 2 and 4 p.m. is when the leading edge will move through. There is a marginal risk for severe weather. Doesn't look like a widespread severe threat, but one of the storms along this line could turn briefly gusty or strong. Those showers and storms clear the coast by about 9 or 10 o'clock, and by Sunday morning, the sun is back, and it's going to feel like a whole different season. Transitioning from summer to fall is what it will feel like. Highs for the next two days, 10 to 15 above average. Then this blast of cool Canadian air sweeps in just in time for the foliage to really start peeking through. Peak foliage right now in the Poconos, nearing peak foliage in the Lehigh Valley, and starting to get close to that near peak range even in southeast Pennsylvania. So your eyewitness weather seven-day forecast, 80s for the next two days, then a huge drop in the mercury. Sunday's cooler and a bit blustery. Next week, though, a sunny, crisp stretch of perfect October weather. Mm, sure is, Kate. Thank you.